Today on Navy Sea Life, we're abandoning the typical treasure hunt and setting sail on a voyage unlike any other, into the world of holes. Yes, you heard that right, holes. Specifically, the seemingly insignificant holes that dot the massive aircraft carrier. These behemoths of modern naval engineering, stretching over 1,000 feet in length and displacing a mind-blowing 100,000 tons when fully loaded, are marvels in and of themselves. Their massive flight decks are a stage for the roar of jets taking off and landing, assisted by sophisticated catapults and arresting gear. But below the flight deck lies a hidden world, a complex city at sea with extensive maintenance facilities, fuel and ammo storage, living quarters for thousands, and advanced command centers. And that's where our tiny heroes come in. Don't let their size fool you. These holes play a critical role in keeping the carrier operational. So join us as we chart a course through the fascinating world of aircraft carrier design, from the thunderous flight deck to the hidden depths below. We'll unveil the secret purpose of these holes and discover why they're anything but ordinary. The importance of aircraft carriers and naval operations cannot be overstated, as they serve as the linchpin of modern maritime strategy. These floating air bases offer unparalleled flexibility and reach, allowing nations to project power across vast expanses of the ocean and exert influence in critical regions around the globe. In times of conflict, carriers play a pivotal role in both offensive and defensive operations, providing air support for ground forces, conducting air strikes against enemy targets, and maintaining maritime superiority through their formidable presence. Moreover, aircraft carriers serve as a symbol of national prestige and deterrence, showcasing a nation's military might and its commitment to protecting its interests on the world stage. In addition to their military significance, aircraft carriers also play a vital role in disaster relief and humanitarian operations. Their ability to deploy aircraft rapidly to remote or disaster-stricken areas enables swift response and assistance during crises, such as natural disasters or humanitarian emergencies. Whether delivering supplies, evacuating civilians, or providing medical aid, aircraft carriers demonstrate their versatility and capacity for global good beyond their traditional role in warfare. Design and Structure Aircraft carriers are meticulously designed to fulfill the complex requirements of naval aviation. At the core of an aircraft carrier's design lies its layout, intricately arranged to optimize flight operations, maintenance activities, and support functions. The flight deck, the most prominent feature of the carrier, sprawls across its upper surface, providing a vast expanse for aircraft takeoffs and landings. Equipped with arresting gear systems and catapults, the flight deck ensures the controlled launch and recovery of aircraft, essential for the carrier's operational effectiveness. Below the flight deck, nestled within the carrier's hull, lies the hangar deck, a spacious chamber where aircraft are stored, maintained, and prepared for missions. The hangar deck houses maintenance facilities, fuel and ammunition storage, and workshops, serving as the operational hub of the carrier's aviation operations. Spoiler alert! There are millions and millions of dollars worth of aircraft and equipment on the hangar deck. If you go even lower beneath the surface of the hangar deck, the hull of an aircraft carrier forms the sturdy foundation upon which the entire vessel rests. This is where those small holes come into play. One intriguing aspect of the carrier's hull is the presence of strategically positioned openings, often mistaken for vulnerabilities. These openings, known as sea chests or intakes, serve a crucial purpose in the carrier's functionality and survivability at sea. Contrary to misconceptions, these holes do not pose a threat to the carrier's structural integrity. Rather, they enhance its operational capabilities. These holes allow seawater to enter the carrier's systems for various essential functions, such as cooling machinery, providing ballast, and facilitating propulsion. They play a vital role in ensuring the carrier's continued operation and maneuverability, exemplifying the ingenuity of naval engineering. 
Delving deeper into the significance of these openings, they serve as conduits for seawater that cools the ship's propulsion systems, such as steam turbines or gas turbines. By allowing seawater to flow into the ship's intake systems, these openings enable the efficient cooling of machinery, prevent overheating, and ensure the uninterrupted operation of critical propulsion systems. Additionally, these openings serve as intake ports for the carrier's desalination plants, which convert seawater into potable water for consumption by the crew. Access to seawater is essential for the desalination process, as it provides the raw material needed to produce fresh water for drinking, cooking, and other essential purposes on board the carrier. Furthermore, these openings may also serve as discharge ports for various waste streams, including wastewater and ballast water. Wastewater generated on board the carrier, such as from sinks, showers, and toilets, is expelled through these openings, ensuring cleanliness and hygiene on board. Similarly, ballast water, used to maintain the carrier's stability and trim during different operational conditions, can be discharged through these ports as needed. Thus, the holes in the carrier hull play a multifaceted role in maintaining the vessel's functionality and operational readiness, underscoring their importance in naval engineering. The small hole. A seemingly inconspicuous feature on an aircraft carrier's deck is the small hole. Despite its unassuming appearance, this humble aperture plays a crucial role in the carrier's overall operation and functionality. Situated strategically across the flight deck and other operational areas, the small hole serves multiple purposes that contribute to the ship's efficiency, safety, and stability. The primary purpose of the small hole is to facilitate ballasting and stability control on board the aircraft carrier. As the carrier navigates through the dynamic marine environment, maintaining proper balance and stability becomes imperative to ensure safe and smooth operations. The small hole allows excess water, whether from rain, seawater splashes, or washdowns, to drain from the deck, preventing it from accumulating and affecting the ship's stability. By regulating the distribution of weight and buoyancy, the small hole helps to maintain the carrier's trim and stability, which are essential for maneuvering and operating effectively at sea. Moreover, the small hole also serves as a vital component of the carrier's drainage system preventing water accumulation on the surface. In the challenging maritime environment, water ingress from various sources, including rain, seawater spray, and operational activities is inevitable. Without adequate drainage mechanisms, accumulated water on the deck poses significant hazards, such as reduced traction for aircraft operations, corrosion of deck materials, and potential safety risks for personnel. The small hole acts as an outlet for excess water, allowing it to drain away swiftly and efficiently, thus mitigating these risks and ensuring the operational readiness of the carrier. To comprehend the importance of drainage on an aircraft carrier deck, it's essential to consider the potential sources of water accumulation. Rainfall, particularly during inclement weather or stormy conditions, can result in significant volumes of water collecting on the deck surface. Additionally, seawater spray generated by high-speed operations such as aircraft takeoffs and landings or ship maneuvers can contribute to water accumulation on the deck. Furthermore, routine maintenance activities such as washing down the deck or servicing aircraft may also result in water runoff that needs to be effectively managed. Without adequate drainage, these sources of water can compromise the carrier's operational efficiency and pose safety hazards for personnel and equipment. The importance of keeping the deck dry extends beyond operational efficiency to encompass broader safety considerations. A wet or slippery deck poses significant risk to flight operations as it can impair aircraft traction during takeoffs and landings, potentially leading to accidents or mishaps. Moreover, water accumulation on the deck surface increases the likelihood of corrosion and deterioration of deck materials over time, necessitating costly repairs and maintenance. By facilitating the swift removal of excess water from the deck surface, the small hole mitigates hazards associated with water accumulation, 
ensuring optimal conditions for flight operations and enhancing the overall operational readiness of the carrier. As an integral component of the ship's infrastructure, the small hole exemplifies the meticulous attention to detail and engineering ingenuity that characterize modern naval vessels. Now, here's a question for all of you out there. Do you know of any other functions or purposes of this hole? And are you aware of any other openings that serve an important purpose? Let us know in the comments below. Environmental Impact the environmental implications of water discharge from aircraft carriers are significant, given the potential impact on marine ecosystems and coastal environments. As essential components of naval operations, aircraft carriers generate wastewater and ballast water that require disposal during routine activities and deployments. However, the discharge of this water can introduce pollutants, contaminants, and invasive species into maritime habitats, posing risks to biodiversity, water quality, and ecosystem health. Consequently, mitigating the environmental impact of water discharge from aircraft carriers is essential to uphold environmental sustainability and minimize adverse effects on marine ecosystems. To address these concerns, Various measures have been implemented to minimize the environmental impact of water discharge from aircraft carriers. One of the primary strategies involves the adoption of advanced wastewater treatment technologies to treat onboard wastewater before discharge. These treatment systems utilize filtration, chemical disinfection, and other processes to remove contaminants and pollutants from wastewater, ensuring compliance with environmental regulations and standards. By treating wastewater on board the carrier, these systems reduce the concentration of harmful substances and minimize the risk of pollution upon discharge into the marine environment. Additionally, stringent protocols and procedures govern the discharge of ballast water from aircraft carriers to prevent the spread of invasive species and pathogens. Ballast water used to maintain the carrier's stability and trim during different operational conditions can inadvertently transport non-native species across marine ecosystems, disrupting ecological balance and biodiversity. To mitigate this risk, carriers implement ballast water management plans that include ballast water exchange, treatment, or retention measures to minimize the transfer of invasive species. These measures help to safeguard native habitats and marine biodiversity while mitigating the ecological impact of ballast water discharge. Furthermore, ongoing research and development efforts focus on the advancement of environmentally friendly technologies and practices to reduce the harmful footprint of aircraft carriers. These include the exploration of alternative propulsion systems, such as hybrid or electric propulsion, to minimize emissions and fuel consumption during operations. Additionally, innovations in waste management, recycling, and resource conservation aim to optimize resource utilization and minimize waste generation on board the carrier. By integrating sustainable practices and technologies into carrier operations, naval forces strive to minimize their environmental impact while maintaining operational effectiveness and readiness. As stewards of the ocean, Naval forces play a crucial role in safeguarding marine biodiversity and preserving the health and integrity of marine ecosystems for future generations. Maintenance and Operation Maintenance procedures for the small hole on aircraft carriers are integral to ensuring the continued functionality and effectiveness of the drainage system. As a critical component of the carrier's infrastructure, the small hole requires regular inspection, cleaning, and maintenance to prevent blockages, corrosion, and deterioration. Maintenance procedures typically involve a combination of routine checks, preventative measures, and corrective actions to address any issues or deficiencies promptly. Firstly, visual inspections are conducted regularly to assess the condition of the small hole and identify any signs of damage, corrosion, or obstruction. During these inspections, crew members examine the surrounding area for debris, sediment buildup, or foreign objects that may impede water damage or compromise the integrity of the drainage system. 
In addition to visual inspections, periodic cleaning and flushing of the small hole are essential to remove accumulated debris, sediment, and biological growth that can obstruct water flow and impair drainage. Cleaning procedures may involve using specialized tools, such as brushes, scrapers, or pressure washers, to dislodge and remove stubborn deposits from the small hole and its surrounding components. Chemical treatments may also be applied to dissolve organic material or prevent the growth of algae, barnacles, or other marine organisms that could impede water drainage and cause corrosion. Furthermore, preventative maintenance measures are implemented to protect the small holes from corrosion, erosion, and other forms of degradation that can compromise its functionality and structural integrity over time. This may include applying corrosion-resistant coatings or protective coatings to the small hole and its surrounding components to minimize the effects of exposure to seawater, salt spray, and environmental elements. Additionally, regular lubrication of moving parts, such as hinges or valves, helps to ensure smooth operation and prevent corrosion or wear that could affect the performance of the drainage system. The maintenance of the small hole is essential for several reasons, highlighting its importance in the overall operation and efficiency of the aircraft carrier. Firstly, proper maintenance of the small hole ensures effective water drainage and prevents water accumulation on the deck surface, reducing the risk of slip and fall accidents and enhancing operational safety for personnel and equipment. By facilitating the swift removal of excess water, the small hole helps to maintain optimal conditions for flight operations, ensuring aircraft traction during takeoffs and landings, and minimizing the potential for accidents or mishaps on the flight deck. Moreover, the maintenance of the small hole is crucial for preserving the structural integrity and longevity of the carrier's infrastructure. By preventing corrosion, erosion and deterioration of the small hole and its surrounding components, maintenance procedures help to extend the service life of the drainage system and minimize the need for costly repairs or replacements in the future. Additionally, regular maintenance of the small hole ensures compliance with environmental regulations and standards governing water discharge from aircraft carriers, minimizing the risk of pollution and environmental damage to marine ecosystems and coastal environments. Operational considerations related to water discharge from aircraft carriers encompass various factors that influence the management and mitigation of environmental impacts. The discharge of water from the small hole during routine operations and deployments can introduce pollutants, contaminants, and invasive species into maritime habitats, posing risks to biodiversity, water quality, and ecosystem health. Consequently, naval forces implement measures to minimize the environmental impact of water discharge, including advanced wastewater treatment technologies, stringent ballast water management protocols, and sustainable operational practices. So there you have it. Those seemingly insignificant holes on an aircraft carrier play a vital role in keeping the ship ship shape and mission ready. We hope you'll learn something new about these unsung heroes of the sea. As always, if you enjoyed this video, smash that like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting dives into the world of the Navy and other maritime marvels. Hit the bell icon to stay notified about our latest uploads and we'll see you on the next voyage. Don't forget to leave a comment in the section below letting us know your thoughts on the environmental impact of these drainage systems and if you think there might be a greener alternative out there. We'd love to hear from you.